Hello friend, this, uh, this video shows MATLAB simulation of push-pull converter. So I am selecting components required for it. So basically this push-pull converter converts DC voltage into DC voltage. That is unregulated DC voltage. Let I select a 100 volt DC input. And now second component we should select is a MOSFET. Yeah. So these MOSFET, there are two MOSFET. Now MOSFET conducts only when they are given PWM. So PWM we can give from a pulse generator. Yeah. Let me select a circuit of um, circuit working at a frequency of uh, that takes 10 kilohertz. 10 kilohertz means this is our period total time period and let one MOSFET be conducting for duty cycle of 50% ok now copy this yes now for uh, pulse width modulation of this MOSFET we need to supply a phase delay uh, 0.00 now another component we need is a transformer and let me use multi vending transformer now we should configure this one In parameter we will select in SI let uh, frequency of our circuit we know is 10 kilohertz let power be 100 watts our input voltage is 100 at primary side of the transformer voltage is 100 100 volt and on secondary it's 25 25 volt and let resistance winding resistance we need let us consider it as ideal transformer let leakage current also be zero assuming it as Idle transformer already tool. Now connect circuit according to you know the circuit diagram of push pull converter. Now what we need is two diodes. Let this uh, inductance be one micro Henry. One micro Henry inductance and then resistive load of 20 ohms. Let it be 20 ohms. Now our circuit diagram is ready. Now what we need that okay. 
but we forgot is a filter capacitor for filter capacitor we should connect a capacitor out before load let it be a standard 47 microfarad now what we need is voltmeter to measure output voltage and a display to show So this circuit, uh, the circuit for push pull converter is being ready, and now you know we have used sim power system components. So we need to add a block of power GUI, and let we make it a discrete. Now we will configure our power GUI block that is using the speed and our frequency 0, 1, 0, 0 time period sampling time period that is 1 by frequency and now we simulate it let's see what kind of output we get we get output of 24 volt that and that is this our converter is working in buck mode Okay, we can't add because simulation is going on. I pause the simulation. Now, if we add a scope and next time onwards, we can see our output voltage. Let's reduce the timing period. Simulation period. Let's see. That would we get. your buck converter and if we change it for the boost mode we just have to make our transformer a step of transformer and let we require a DC output voltage of 400 volt we just need to change configuration of transformer and run simulation again and see what we are getting your DC output of boost mode. Thank you friends for continuously watching my videos and